Our quick look, uh, not too colorful, might have a couple of sprinkles, might have been, uh, if I would not be surprised, had a couple of flurries flying around on the plateau as well. Uh, nothing major, but we will see a few of those sprinkles continuing. Look at this beautiful shot sent in from Jeff Stiles, Fredonia Mountain, and just a beautiful, he said it was the end of the rainbow, and he's spending that gold right now, I'll bet you, but it literally looks like you could stand there, reach out, and grab it. That is beautiful. You can send pictures into weather at local3news.com. Right now, 46 degrees in Chattanooga. Not Nice breeze though. Look at that wind blowing out of the west northwest 14 miles per hour, making it feel like a brisk 40. It is 46 in Dalton, 45 Cleveland, 39 degrees in Murphy. Temperatures running way below where they were this time yesterday. 20 degrees colder in Altamont, 9 degrees colder in Chattanooga, 22 degrees colder in Fort Payne, and 15 degrees colder in the great city of Murphy, North Carolina. Our wind chills, well, take a look. Wind chill all the way down to 27 on the plateau. Uh, it feels like 40 in Dalton, feels like 35 in Blue Ridge, feels like 34 in Murphy. Heading into Monday, it's going to be chilly tomorrow morning, 37 in Chattanooga. Chattanooga climbing into the upper 40s. We'll hit a high of about 49 degrees. Mostly cloudy in the morning, but we will see some clearing during the afternoon and the evening of your Monday. So let's take a look at our radar and satellite. There is the low behind that low. We had some showers working their way through the Tennessee Valley this morning. A few lingering this afternoon. You can see the bulk of that moisture off to the northeast, though, and that is where it will continue to go. As we continue to move through the night tonight, if we have a little wintry mix in the northern end of the plateau later this evening, wouldn't be surprised. And then east of Murphy heading up into the uh, eastern Cherokee County and the higher elevations might see some light snow showers developing there tonight. Moving into Monday, looks like we're just going to see mostly cloudy skies to start the day. Again, we'll be in the mid 30s and then clearing out late in the day on Monday. We're looking good for Tuesday. What another system coming in. Uh, this one, no problems Tuesday on through five o'clock and then Tuesday night into Wednesday morning. This low is going to dive southward as it does. We'll have some scattered showers very light late Tuesday night into early Wednesday morning. Will we see a little bit of a wintry mix in some of the higher elevations? Maybe, but again, this is going to be some really light stuff and I don't expect any problems with it. This is Wednesday morning on into the early afternoon. We may see a few sprinkles remaining, but you're going to see again as that low works its way eastward, a lot of that moisture getting dragged eastward Wednesday afternoon. So Wednesday afternoon into Wednesday night, we'll see everything tapering off and coming to an end as the low pressure moves out and high pressure builds in. And that's going to start a dry period Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday, and probably beyond. Well, the rain showers Tuesday night into Wednesday morning, again, are not going to amount to much. We're talking about most folks getting less than a tenth of an inch of rain. Might see a little bit more up toward the Blue Ridge. Tonight, 37 degrees for the overnight low, cloudy, a few sprinkles, and a, bl a bit blustery, and mid to upper 30s, um, or I should just say mid 30s, really, in the valley, low 30s and higher elevations. Those winds are going to stay breezy at 10 to 15 miles per hour. The winds will lighten up tomorrow, coming out of the northwest, a high of only 49, uh, so it should be a cool, crisp, but nice afternoon for you. Uh, 49 in Chattanooga, 46 Cleveland, 48 in Dalton, and your storm alert, seven-day forecast. Uh, the only thing that we're looking at, really, in the near future is a nice little warm up after a freezing start to the day Tuesday. We'll climb to 56 on Tuesday afternoon. Light showers Tuesday night into early Wednesday morning, clearing out 49 Wednesday afternoon, and then chilly mornings, but really pleasant afternoons Thursday through the weekend. Highs in the mid to upper 50s, Cornelia.